Greg here with Minor Tech, back up in Egan, Minnesota, where we do all our manufacturing and distribution. So I wanted to um, do a little video on a paper for heat transfers called Image Clip Laser Dark. It's uh, made by Nina Paper. It's one of the few products that we sell that we actually don't manufacture. We distribute this particular product. But it's a great product when you want to put colors down on dark garments shirt, black shirts, blue shirts, red shirts, whatever, but dark garments specifically, this one's designed for. It's a two-part system, meaning you have two pieces of paper, you have your image sheet, and that is a, this happens to be 8.5 by 11, they do have an 11.17 as well. Um, this paper we printed on our Oki data printer, which is the 711WT, which actually has a white toner cartridge in it. So that, in this particular case, we printed our colors, we printed white throughout this area, and then the white actually is covering the rest of the image as well. Now, what that does is it helps start to build opacity so that we, um, when we put it down onto a dark garment, we get the colors to stand out. But we want to make that even a little bit better. So we have our image clip laser dark transfer sheet. It's a piece of paper where it has a solid white coating on it. We're going to marry those together, such as this. I like to flip back that little corner so it's easier to grab and pull because this is going to be a hot, hot peel. Um, what I then do is I flip it so I have my image sheet on top. We have a rubber mat. Put it in there. And I'm going to press this for 15 seconds at 330 degrees. Now, Nina would tell you to do it at 250 degrees for 25 seconds. And 25 seconds is be a little long at this higher temperature. So we cut that down. We then take it peel it right away because it's a hot peel. You can see that we've covered everywhere there was toner, we've now covered it with a white coating. And you might be able to see that it's actually come off of that sheet as well. That's discarded and we now have the sheet that we're going to transfer down onto our shirt. So I don't need my pad any longer. Okay, so I have my shirt I'm going to put it on my press. You know what? Let's do the back of it instead of the front this time. Get it lined up. And as with all heat transfer papers going on to uh, fabric, we recommend that you do press it for about 10 seconds. Um, that will certainly take any wrinkles out, but at the same time, moisture out of the shirt itself. I take my image, put it in position, and I'm now going to press this at the same temperature, 330 degrees, for 25 seconds. Now, Nina then would have you raise the temperature to 375 and do for 25 seconds. You know, if you only have one heat press, it's really hard to be going back and forth and doing these types of things with the waiting time, waiting for it to cool back down. So that's why we do it at 3.30 for 15 seconds and 25 seconds. We've pressed it on, and they recommend that you do a cool peel. So this one is going to be cooling off, and in the meantime, I had one pressed earlier, so we're going to do the peel. Everything that was on that piece of paper is transferred over, only toner, and we now have our shirt. Crisp, brilliant colors, nice white. Now what I'm going to do is I like to, when I peel these off, I like to give it one more press for just a few seconds so that 
it definitely is bonded into the fibers of the shirt. And I'm going to use a piece of parchment paper on top of that so I don't stick it to the heating element. And I'm only going to give it five seconds. And again, we have our shirt, Image Clip Laser Dark from Nina Paper. Thanks for watching. I hope you like it. Give it a try. Please give us a like.